Watching that snow melt along the Ogden River already concerning residents there. We sent photojournalist Tracy Smith to see how to prepare for the rising water. The record breaking snow is starting to melt and that gives Utahns who live along the Ogden River a twofold problem. One is the ground is saturated with water and two, the river is rising. Right now, the Ogden River is flowing at 1,060 cubic feet per second, and it's going to continue to rise um, as the weather starts warming up, which we're expecting to happen in the next few days. Weber County has been kind enough to provide sandbags for us, so a buddy of mine uh, and I are going down tomorrow with his truck to uh, pick up sandbags and to do some sandbagging on the more vulnerable areas. They need to be prepared to have groundwater problems and so they need to prepare by going and, and purchasing sump pumps and, and doing things to be able to remove groundwater that might be infiltrating into their foundation. Um, we haven't really done too much as far as like sandbags or any uh, preparation like that goes um, in our basements because we do have pumps down there that have been um, doing pretty good so far. The river's about 1,060 cubic feet per second. As it rises to 2,100 cubic feet per second, that boardwalk across the way, you're gonna have water all the way up to the bottom of that at 2,100 cubic feet per second and actually going all the way underneath of it. And you're gonna see the water so high that it is actually gonna be slapping this bridge deck and, and it's gonna be impeded by this bridge. You can see the water rising behind me and the city's made a lot of improvements to help control the water. But some remember what happened in 1983. I had two cabins up in Ogden Canyon right there by the Hermitage, which is by the Alaska then. They actually uh, put sandbags up about six feet and it still went over the banks. I mean, once it started, it's hard to fix. If you prepare ahead of time, your chances are much better for uh, handling whatever comes your way. Because when it hits here, uh, I'll tell you what, it's cooking. From that perspective, you do become aware of it quickly when that river comes up. The Ogden River is actually a perched river, higher in elevation than the surrounding um, properties to the north and to the south. Water gets out of this area, yes, we're going to have water running both directions. Ogden City officials say there's another danger. The water is freezing cold. They ask that you be careful around the edges and that you keep children and pets away from the river. Reporting in Ogden, Tracy Smith, ABC4 News.